All right, how you doing out there, guys? Uh, uh, my next segment in my uh, Vortec head swap here. I got both heads uh, painted up with the roller rockers installed. Uh, let you take a look at them, see what you think. They came out pretty good. Uh, a <clears throat> couple things I want to tell you if anybody out there is taking on this project. Uh, the paint you want to use. This here Duplicolor Engine Enamel High Heat Chevrolet Orange. Uh, DE1620 is the name of the, uh, the number on the can. Good stuff. And uh, <clears throat> also, before you paint, you know, after you get the heads back from the machine shop, they're in pretty good shape, but they still have machine oil on them and that, you know? So, before you paint them, there's this other Duplicolor product I found is real good. It's a, called a Prep Wipe. And it's... Uh, it removes grease and wax, cleans and prepares surface for painting, and uh, you wipe that down, and uh, bang, you hit it with the engine enamel over here, and you're good to go. They even sell a clear coat that I could have put on top of this, but these babies are shining. I mean, they look good. I'm not gonna bother with it, so. Anyway, uh, one other thing while I got you here. <clears throat> I mentioned I need an intake for this project, and it's uh, it's a Vortec TBI intake. I jotted it down here on my, I got all my my project stuff here. Uh, it's made by General Motors uh, Performance Products, and the part number right here one two four nine six eight two one. And if anybody has any, if anybody has one, uh, send me a personal message. I'm interested. I need one, and I don't want to buy a uh, brand new. It's, phew, I'm trying to save a buck. You know, like I said, things are tight, and uh, I spent a lot on this as it is. So, if anybody has it, uh, give me a PM. <coughs> and uh, as I go along, I'll uh, I'll make some updates. Okay. All right, take it easy, everybody. Have a good day. All right. <laughs>